Hi, I'm Carol Haley and earlier this year I completed my PhD in creative writing at Swansea University. I'm going to read you the prologue from my novel, which is called Rain. There is a hill. 600 million years ago, the fires of a supervolcano fling minerals into the sky. Feldspar and pyroxene and olivine, augite and magnetite and ilmenite fall back to earth, sinking through oceans to the deep, dark places where rocks are made. For an unimaginable time, the rocks drift across the surface of the earth until 60 million years ago, a cataclysmic rift heaves them from the sea and the hill is made. For the longest time, the hill has no name because there are no people to give it a name. Weather batters it, softening its sharp peaks and rivers cut through it, sculpting clefts, ridges and valleys. Again and again the air grows cold and the hill is scraped clean by glaciers until finally, 10,000 years ago, the ice retreats and does not return. Life flourishes, rain seeps deep into the earth, springs rise and a stream slips down the hill. Seeds scatter on the wind and trees and grasses grow. The unnamed hill is one of many, nubs of a spine dividing sea from pasture. 5,000 years ago, people arrive at the foot of the hill. They climb to the top and know that this is the place they have been searching for. Somehow they push and pull and roll huge stones to the top of the hill and raise them in a circle. These people give the hill a name and they hold the name close so no one but them will know it. They use the stone circle for sacred ceremonies and the hill is as precious to them as the stones they have raised upon it. 2,000 years ago, different people come to the hill. These people have tools for shaping iron. They admire the sheltered valley below the hill. The grass is lush for their animals and the earth is fertile so their crops grow tall and plump. They settle near a bend in the river. They are watched by the birds wheeling far above them and the people see them and call their home Bird Valley. These people don't know why there is a circle of stones on the top of the hill, so they make up stories about it. Some of them see gods inside the circle. <laughs>